at 6, 10 a.m. And in an hour, I'll have started my first ever road trip. Wait, sorry, too far. Go back, go back. Okay, wow, I'm really doing this. Now you may be thinking, where am I going? And why am I telling you? Well, I've never really done a road trip before, and uh, I'm very excited about it, especially one by myself. And uh, so I thought I would share with you. You know, it's kind of like a blog, um, but it's a video, like a, a video blog, like a, like a blogio. I think that's what I'm gonna call it, a blogio. So, since no one else has ever done this before, I figured I would take you guys along the ride for me. And I'm looking at myself, not the camera. I don't know if that's good or not. Anyway, I'm going to Big Sur. Let's do it. Out there. made my first stop. I don't know where I am. I saw some cool fields. I kind of want to take some drone shots and uh, I turned into this abandoned store. I don't know. There's another car here, but uh, yeah, I'm going to bring out the drone and see what I can get. Hello? I think maybe I should get out of here. It's kind of freaky. I'm not gonna lie. All right, so basically it's an abandoned store. That was fun. I'm at a pit stop in San Luis for gas. I'm just gonna fill up so that I don't have to worry about it on the last stretch of the journey. But yeah, we're almost there. Look at, look at that sculpture. 
How interesting. All right. Okay, I know I said uh, I was gonna go back on the road. However, I found this. And I thought I would just walk around. I think the actual museum's closed, of course, uh, but got a couple interesting things outside, so let's go look at those. They have a tank. So, you know. Okay. I think it would be pretty cool to get my COVID test with a tank, you know? That would be pretty cool. All right, back on the road, for real. All right, I've made it to Monterey. I'm currently parked up the street from Carmel by the Sea. I have 40 minutes before I need to get to my Airbnb reservation. So I'm gonna try to go uh, eat lunch on the beach. Definitely a good thing I brought that first aid kit. I already gave myself a, a cut on my plastic bag box. All right. Airbnb, I think. Who designed this room? Get it? <laughs> okay, well, made it. The hard part, the, the driving part is done. Until I have to go back, of course. But yeah, this is where I'm spending the first night. Kind of, kind of nice. Right now, I think I'm going to find the restrooms, use those, have a snack. Uh, then I don't know. Might explore around here a little bit, uh, but I also want to go back. I think I'm going to have dinner uh, in Carmel or Monterey. Get something from a restaurant there. And then I'll come back, obviously. And, and that'll be that. All right. Well, I found the restroom, so I can't, I can't bring you guys on this part of the journey, sorry.
just did some flying with my drone. Almost lost the drone because of a connection. That was scary, but we're it's good. We're good. I think I've decided on a restaurant I want to go to in Monterey. I've never gone to a restaurant by myself before. This will be interesting. Solo trips are interesting. You like how you experience them is totally different than doing it with your family or with a loved one or with friends, you know. It's good though. So I've got an hour about about an hour before I should leave, so I'm gonna go explore more of the tent area. So let's go. Turns out I'm not good at horseshoes. Guess probably can't use the sauna. That is interesting that that's there. And it looks like a barrel. amazing you just you feel like you're in a different world you know especially compared to what I'm used to where I live and it's not like any camping experience I've had before it doesn't you know it's not the wilderness but it's secluded and um, atmospheric there's a lot of ambiance here and the views are just just kiss okay might go a little earlier than I was expecting for dinner because, well, I finished kind of exploring, you know, it's not a whole lot. I mean, they have some cool games and stuff. It's not a whole lot of, you can do when you're by yourself. Um, I would go on the trails, but kind of tired. I'm not sure what else I'm going to do here. So rather than just sitting on my bum, I think I'm going to go, going to go to dinner. Bye. <laughs> done. That was good and my waiter was nice. Shout out to Rachel. If you ever come to the beach house at Lover's Point, Rachel, she's great. made it back to the tent. Yeah, that was fun. Dinner was really good. Now I'm just kind of lying here. 7.23, sunset's about 7.33, so in a few minutes I'll probably go out, light the fire, um, eat some popcorn, play guitar, have a nice relaxing night.
See you tomorrow. Because I'm an idiot.